a performing arts studio. Uh, we have classes in vocal acting and all styles of dance. Um, we also perform shows here in our little small Black Box Theater. Um, we uh, also have a competition thespian team. We go to Access Broadway down in Orlando and we are hoping this year to make it to Nationals up in New Jersey in June. Mindy Duchesne launched St. John's Stage for a simple reason. Because there's just nowhere down here in St. John's County, nor at the time was there anywhere that offered classes to teach the technique to sing, act, and dance for school-age children, as well as have the opportunity to do shows all in one place. She explains the benefits of a performance group like St. John Stage. The benefit would be um, not only do you have the opportunity to perform in a show, uh, but during that show process, we teach you all of the aspects of what you need to learn as far as backstage, as far as prop development, uh, costume design. And then during our classes, we teach you the foundations of vocal. Vocal health is a big thing with me, as well as use your voice. Acting techniques as far as uh, character development, um, and then of course all of the dance styles, because to be on Broadway, you've got to at least know how to do a jazz square. <laughs> Let's get the students' perspective. Part of it is different to where, with this, we're being judged at competitions, and we get more time with each other, too. So it is um, easier to build friendships and get to know each other. I've always liked theater. I've always been involved around it, and always liked like, having fun and stuff like that. And um, my mom found a place where I could do it, and I was trying it out, and I really liked the teachers and all, like the family and how everyone really like got in as a family, and it just really inspired me to do it even more. Um, well, okay, so I knew Miss Mindy Deshane um, beforehand at an old studio that she'd owned. Um, so uh, when she left to start her own new studio, I was like, oh, you know what? I'll join hers because she's a great director, um, and it's really fun. And personally, I just like to do theater because. I've never been so much of like a sports person or anything and so theater has just been really fun like acting, singing and dancing. I just thought it's been kind of a cool passion for me. So, yeah. So it's fun and will help them get to future productions outside of St. John's. Maybe Broadway, more likely college opportunities. So I asked the fellas what it's like to be the minority in the group. Wait for it. But we do have uh, a couple other guys, older guys too, and a couple other younger guys. And well, I do love the ladies. It's nice to have the other. It's nice to have the, some of the guys too to hang out with. Bladouche. They host their spring showcase this weekend. Mindy's daughter Michaela played an integral part in creating the theme Revolutions. She explains. Um, well, being a current college student, I'm exposed to a lot of politics all of the time. So I um, am constantly overflowed with just so many different revolutionary ideas. And I thought now would be a really great time to do an entire showcase based on different revolutions throughout history. For everybody, we want to make sure that here that we are teaching our students valuable life lessons that they can take out into the world. Whether they use it in the performing arts or not, we want to make sure that they're learning about the world that they live in and the history behind it and we want to make sure that we can influence some impactful messages towards the audience to go home and think about and consider. I'm Rance Adams for River City Live. St. John's Stage holds their showcase, The Art of Revolution, this Saturday at 1 p.m. At, located at 11200 St. John's Pet Parkway. Get tickets and find out more information about the performing arts group at stjohnstage.com.